Okay. Hi, you guys. Karen. Just coming to you from Yerba Buena Gardens here in San Francisco. See, look how pretty everything is. The night sky. And all these little fountains over here. That's really pretty, pretty huh? And I just came back from this hotel up here. You can't really see it because of the three, three branches. But yeah, I just came from there to film the pop up wedding chapel for my journalism class. Um, basically, it was just a bunch of couples who wanted to go get married, have a commitment ceremony, or renew their wedding vows. It was really a great ceremony. I got a lot of free desserts and champagne out of that. I also got a cocktail. But, um,. Yeah, and it was a lot of fun talking to the couples and wondering what the reasons were for getting married or renewing their vows. There's a lot of different people from all different kinds of backgrounds. Anyway, I'm going to be working on that all day today, tonight, and tomorrow. It's going to be crazy, but hopefully something good will come out of it. You can go to express.sfsu.edu to be a final product, which won't be until later this week. Anyway, I hope you guys all had a good Valentine's Day. I had a blast, well, no, not really, actually, last night was kind of disappointing. Okay, so um, after I did my last entry, I ended up going to Andrew's house, I was the guy I met at the Star Trek convention, and we watched The Next Generation with two of his friends, and um, there were good episodes, not much else. Um, I saw his room, there's a lot of really dorky things in there, not just in his room, but like in his entire apartment, <laughs> but he lives in a really cool place. Anyway, after that, Nicole, Joanna, and I watched Valentine's Day, and now that was a disappointment. Like, I can't really explain it, like, it didn't make me feel anything one way or another, and like, there were just too many characters. There were a lot of good characters, and there were some good storylines, but I wanted to see some of them develop more. Um, the thing I was most disappointed about was the lack of Bradley Cooper and McSteamy because, <laughs> okay, I'm sorry to spoil the movie for you, but basically they're gay. Haha, <laughs> I spoiled it for you. But, yeah, and I wanted to see them kiss, but they didn't even do anything. So, that was kind of a drag. But, you know, what can you do? I kind of wish I didn't get to see the movie, though, because we ended up not drinking or, like, going to the bar. We ended up at three different places. And then we ended up driving around downtown and we couldn't find anything. So we ended up going to Denny's. We got to go at Denny's. And then we ate at my house like at four in the morning. And we were just so tired and stuff. Like we didn't even talk very much. It was so lazy and uh, didn't go as well as planned. But it was nice to spend time with my friends anyway. And that's always a good thing. Anyway, I don't really want to do this video blog anymore because people are probably looking at me. <laughs> but um, I hope you guys all had a good Valentine's Day. You guys are all lovely, and you guys are my Valentines, even if you don't think so. I think so. All right, we'll talk to you later. Bye.